Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is another one of my video tips of the week. In this week's tip, I'm going to show you how to copy a DVD to a USB thumb drive and play that DVD on any computer using the thumb drive only. Doing this is pretty easy. All you have to do is download one piece of software, put it on the thumb drive, and then copy the contents of the DVD over. Let me show you what I mean. What you're seeing on the screen here is my computer, and you notice I have a C drive, and I have a DVD drive, I have E drive, and I have what I call a movie drive, and that happens to be my thumb drive. And if I click on my DVD, it's going to run, but I've copied the full contents from this DVD over into my thumb drive, and if I click on that, you'll see that there's a file on the thumb drive that says Play DVD on PC. And if I click that link, the DVD starts playing and just like all other DVDs the menus work I can click the menu items I can click pause I can click all the other details it has audio and video and this works on the Mac as well as PC so let me show you how you do this first thing you want to do is go to this website newsiberian.com and then go to dvd-on-usb.html and this is the site where you get the software now to download the software you just click this link right here download DVD on USB while the download is going down, you may want to watch these videos that show you how to do the install. Now when I got the download, I got a little warning message that said this file is not commonly downloaded and do you want to keep it? Now because I do have active security scan, it scanned the zip file for me and found out there was nothing on it that I needed to worry about. So here's the security warning right here. I'm going to keep that file. Once it's downloaded, I choose to show in folder and then I'm going to choose extract all and it tells me it's going to extract here. I'm just going to give it a file name and extract. And you see that there are a large number of files here, 1800. Uh, most of those are Mac related. I'll show you how to get rid of those if you're not going to be using this on a Mac. Now that it's extracted, you can see all the files. And you can see there's really only five files here. There's the new Siberian file. There's the Play DVD on Mac. You'll want to keep this if you're going to be using this on a Mac, but if you're not going to be using this on a Mac, delete that folder. We're going to delete it right here because I'm not using this on a Mac. And then I'm also going to open New Siberian and there's a VLC portable Mac. I'm going to delete that because I'm not going to be using that. And that's going to eliminate about 1800 files that you're not going to use. Now all you have to do now is, is select all these and copy these to a thumb drive. And once you've copied those to a thumb drive, the thumb drive is going to look like this. And the thumb drive will have these files on it. The thing you'll want to do next is to go to your DVD drive and copy the video TS folder and paste it onto your thumb drive. Now the video TS folder is probably going to be fairly large, so copying it over may take some time depending on the speed of your DVD drive. Once you have it copied over, all you have to do then is put the thumb drive into your computer, into your laptop, any device that has a USB, and then click play DVD on PC. and the DVD will start playing. Again, this is for the PC side. It's really easy to do. Now, if you want to do the Mac version, when you download this file, there's instructions that tell you how to do it. It's fairly easy. The instructions look like this. It tells you how to play the DVD on USB. For Windows users, which we've just gone through, for Mac users, the instructions are pretty much the same in just a different formatting. Once it's done, you can copy your DVDs onto thumb drives and take those thumb drives with you, play them on your tablet device. If it has a USB port, or play them on your netbook or any other thing that has a USB port. Anyway, the program that we used is from New Siberian, and you can download this program for free. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips of the week. You can find more like this at www.bmyers.com.